In this video, I will share with you five bulletproof ways you can maximize your daily productivity and make every hour of every single day count. Hi guys, hope you're doing well. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're an entrepreneur, a content creator, or a working mama, then you've come to the right place. Don't aim to be busy, strive to be productive. I'm a working mama. Productivity, time management, and efficiency are my best friends. That's the only way I can be a good mom, grow my business, and not lose my sanity in the process. Over the years, I've developed systems that help me stay on top of my busy life, stay productive, and keep moving in the right direction towards achieving my biggest goals. If you're new to my channel, my name is Veronica. I'm a multi-passionate entrepreneur, photographer, and content creator. And if you're ready to maximize your daily productivity, make sure you like this video and tune in. Tip number one, have a to-do list. Listing exactly what you need to do will give you clarity. I have multiple to-do lists for each area of my life. Life. I have annual lists, quarterly lists, monthly lists, weekly lists, and daily lists. Be very specific when you write your to-dos. Rachel Hollis calls her to-do lists results lists. And since I adopted her strategy, my productivity skyrocketed. Rather than writing down write content for Instagram, be very specific and put down write seven posts for Instagram. Do you see the difference? And that's exactly what I do. I've also developed a downloadable to-do list template, which will help you prioritize your tasks and get clarity. You can find the template by following the link in the description. Tip number two, plan your days. To get the most out of your day, you need to clearly see how much time you have to work with each day. I plan my week every single Sunday and I adjust my schedule every single day. I schedule my non-negotiable tasks first. Things like photo shoots, appointments, and meetings go in my calendar before everything else does. I fill in the gaps with my high priority and time sensitive tasks. Then I slot in my wish list tasks. I also leave some time slots empty as contingency because I'm a mom and life happens. I can always use a little wiggle room in my calendar. Tip number three batch work. I love batch working. The notion of batch working has been foreign to me for many years, but since I've adopted the strategy, I changed my productivity game 180 degrees. I mean, productivity and efficiency are my best friends now, and I mean it. I get to do so much more in the limited time I get as a working mom. It's mind-blowing. I still remember the first time I sat down to batch my Instagram captions for the entire week. After I was done, I had to take a moment and quickly realize that that week, I was going to be able to show up every single day, even if I didn't feel inspired or time got away from me. Wow, just wow. Then I started thinking, what if I scheduled my emails for the month ahead? What if I filmed a month worth of videos in one day? What if I batch this or batch that? I did. I tried it and I loved it. Batch working can save you a huge amount of time and energy. Okay, let's look at the numbers for a second. It takes about one hour to get everything ready, including myself, to shoot a video, and about one hour to actually shoot it. That's two hours every single week and eight hours a month in total. If I get everything set up once and film four videos in a row, mathematically that adds up to five hours. That frees up about three extra hours that I can spend working on other things in my business or spending time with my family. See the difference? Plus, when you're batching, your work is so much more focused. It takes a little while to get into the right mind frame for creative writing. Once I get myself there, I write without stopping until I'm done, simply to take advantage of the momentum. Imagine if I had to do all of that work to get myself into the right mind frame to write one caption every single evening. That time and energy I can certainly utilize in other areas of my life. Batch working is something that entrepreneurs, including myself, live by, and so should you. Do you want to be productive, work efficiently, and protect your time and energy that you can give to your loved ones instead? Batch work. Tip number four, eliminate distractions. Did you know that on average, people pick up their phone about 80 times a day? Crazy number, isn't it? Pause for a moment and ask yourself, why do I pick up my phone? Is it to scroll on Instagram, reply to emails, watch YouTube, create content? And please be honest with yourself. Then ask yourself the following question. How often do I pick up my phone during my set workouts? The answer should be 
zero. Since becoming a mom, I've realized that my work schedule will never be the same. So I had to set some very firm rules to make sure I can maximize productivity within my set work hours. Rule number one, turn off social media app notifications when I work. Rule number two, do not pick up your phone unless it's an urgent call. Rule number three, focus on one task at a time. My work hours are a lot shorter now. That means I can't afford losing my precious work hours on distractions. You'll be amazed how much you can actually accomplish in just one hour when you fully focus on your work. And tip number five, start your day right. Wake up before the kids do and get ahead of your day. Have a solid morning routine that will get you in the right mind frame and boost your energy. Start your day with gratitude. Be active, move your body, do things that bring you joy. If you win your morning, you win your day, your week, your month, your life. If you found this video helpful, please make sure to leave me a like, comment below, let me know and help me spread the word so I can help budding content creators and entrepreneurs to follow their passion, take action and start working for their dreams. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel right here and if you wish to learn more about time management, make sure to check out this playlist over here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you later.